Hi everyone, it's Barry, and today I cannot wait to teach you how to make my signature Barry's omelet bomblets. For this recipe, you're going to be needing eggs, paprika, salt, pepper, bacon, and an herb of your choice. Girl Scouts are going to be using an oven and a knife for this project as well as a stove, so be sure you have an adult present. First, what you're going to do is you're going to get five strips of bacon and you're going to separate them on a cutting board. Make sure that your pan on your stove is heated up and cook your bacon strips. And then once they're done cooking, you're going to set them on a paper plate. Be sure that that paper plate, or it can just be a regular plate, has a paper towel on it to help soak up the grease of the bacon so it doesn't interfere with the cooking of our eggs later on. Our next step is going to be cracking all of our eggs into a bowl and we're going to mix them together very well. We're going to add in all of our seasonings and then we're going to mix that together too. I'm also adding in some Tabasco because I really like my eggs to have a little bit extra flavor. Now, see here, we're I have a spout at the end of my bowl. I'm going to fill up all of my egg trays, which I have pre-sprayed with nonstick cooking spray. Now it's all filled up, ready to go. Be sure to cut some cheese or bacon up if you want those as your toppings, or you can always have your bacon on the side with your eggs after they're done cooking. Now you can set them into the oven, which was preheated at 350 degrees and cook them for seven minutes. If the eggs aren't firm to the touch, like they are how I'm touching them very lightly, then you put them in for an extra two minutes until they are finished. You grab an oven mitt and put them on a heat safe stove top or countertop. I use my stove. I'm waiting for them to cool before I can dish them out onto the paper plates for my family. I put tomatoes and avocado with them because it makes them even more yummy. These are delicious bomblets and I can't wait for you to enjoy.